Hi guys, Pickles the Gaijin here, Jamaican YouTuber. Welcome back to my channel. New merch people, show. New merch people, Shogunai. I saw it go. So you know, please make sure you go to the my link down below to cop the merch. We got it in hood. We got pullovers. We got t-shirts. We got long sleeve shirts. We have the mask as well. Wait, where's the mask? I don't know where the mask, but we do have the mask as well. Uh, so please make sure you support my channel. It would really mean a lot if you do. And um, yeah, support your black content creators. All right, shout out to Truly Coily, who who's has, has been done my starter locks and has kept maintaining them. So my locks are coming along nice to be visiting me. Actually, Empress Cece started it, but she, she's left Japan. So I guess you guys don't need to know about her. But if you do, check out for Empress CC on Instagram. She's when I started my locks. It's not it's not interlock. It's uh yeah, it's a loose version. I mean, I don't forget palm roll or whatever. Palm roll. Anyway, just like here, but here look nice. I feel good. And I'm happy and feeling great about myself. Now it has been a couple weeks since I um, had my Corona battle, and um, a lot of persons were concerned. Well, not really concerned, but really worried for me going back out into the real world. No, there are many different theories that are positive that you know for Corona. I mean, I'm a social person. I um, I'm an MC slash artist slash DJ slash YouTuber. So I, outside is where I make my business. I go to work, and after that I go and do other things to kind of bring in some more bread and also to, to fulfill my passions. Yes, I understand being careful and so on. But yeah. Um, but yeah, I have some bookings I need to do. I need to take care of it. And I went. To, I've been to two parties since two, two and a half. Um, most part, I've been wearing my mask mostly for most of it. I've uh, been sanitizing my hands and stuff like that. And the parties have been well, too hotter vibes zone, uh, which I'm a member of. The uh, other person actually, DJ Heat, hotter vibes himself. And we've been just shutting it down like crazy. Uh, madness, total madness. Uh, if, if you have an event in Japan, I need vibes. We play everything soca, afro beats, dance hall. I said everything, I've only played three things really. But yeah. But speaking of which, th there is an issue I want to talk about in general, but we're not going to go into that right away. Right away. Um, so, since even before Corona, uh, I thought my things things were looking for me for dating in Japan. I thought things were looking up for me dating in Japan. I was matching a couple of people on Bumble, act having actual conversations with actual people and not bots, getting to know people. And uh, I guess for some reason or another, shit just got COVID. It just got COVID. It got cancelled. It got. That's it. That's 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 the message, you know. And I, I wonder sometimes if. I am the one that's the reason for all of this because that, that the common factor is Andre. You know, the common factor is Piggles in these interactions. And both persons are not, are, are, have a, are foreign esque, I guess, foreigners. And I don't get it. What, what am I doing wrong? What did I do? I mean, I don't want to see you too clingy and message constantly or just try to balance between that. I, have, I haven't done the clingy messaging in, in a minute. Um, for me, if I like you, I like you. And I don't need to be going around bush and meeting around bush. Uh, apparently, uh, maybe I don't know who's trying to balance anymore. Or, you know, so there's, I guess, I don't know. People don't use words as much as they use words anymore. Hey, so one with one girl, uh, one lady, she's half Japanese, half another. I don't want to uh, give out too much information. But we're talking well on, on back and forth on bumble then we went on the line and we talked a bit for a while and then things just got whatever she ignored me for a whole week i think and she replied oh i'm sorry i was i was feeling sick so i didn't mean to ignore her, but i was feeling sick totally fine so i said right after she said i message you know are you feeling better now up to no i got no response so after i came out of hospital with the covid i said hey you know i just overcame covid i was in hospital hope you guys are staying safe because i know she has a um she lives with her grandma so i just want to make sure everything's okay I said oh that's good. okay so be careful okay fine before i've asked hey would you like i think before it, that whole 
the whole corona episode i asked like if you want to like i think i said if you want to meet up for a virtual coffee or so just to kind of know because of corona people are scared we go probably go each go to a starbucks buy a coffee and video call each other and talk i mean just you know just to kind of you know what i mean mixed up a bit i thought that would be cute or cool or whatever but i guess maybe it is what it is so i guess that's my fault maybe something will happen in the future i don't know i'll message her again and see what's happening but that's there so that's basically dead then there's another pr one that um i guess we started off okay we need a video call like the first week we met and then the communication started to to win and you know the times the schedules were not syncing up because both of us are busy people out there working making our money and you know i guess in the end it doesn't even matter because i tried so hard Shogunai, pretty much. Dating in Japan, pretty much for me, has been a whole Shogunai. It can't be helped. It can't be helped because clearly I am just not cut out for this sort of thing. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe persons have been giving me signals. If you've been giving me signals, just send a message to me. Say, hey, like me. And we can go up on a date. I can't bother with the games. I'm 35. I can't be bothered with this nonsense anymore. I refuse to go back to jamaica next year single that is definitely well if i went back single mm, i'm gonna go back to jamaica with a girlfriend next year go buy a ticket and lord god that's about two four hundred dollars already for a ticket and then you know you have your broth oh god anyway that's beyond the point so fine you know whatever that didn't work out i haven't met anybody in real life then i met there's somebody in my vlog i don't know if you saw somebody in my vlog a dj I thought there was something there or something, but I don't know. She already hit me with the, oh, I'm busy. Bye -bye. The, oh, I'm busy. Once the girl go, Isagashi des, it is over. That is a, <clears throat> the people's ever say, oh, yeah, ghosted. Better she ghost me. Um, yeah, so I don't know what's going to happen there. I just don't have the amount of luck I think I deserve. But at the end of the day, it's night. <laughs> no, it's not funny. It's corny and lame. Anyway, so remember, Shogunai, so you go. It's just Jamaican and Japanese. Jamaican and Japanese, yeah. So, um, and, and with that, people, you know, are we sabotaging? Are we, are we as a people, me as a person, disrupting my group effort of trying to get in a relationship? Is, do I really want a girlfriend? Or is it that society is pressuring me to feel that I need a companion? I would like somebody to come home to sometimes. I'm not gonna lie. I would like, you know, you know somebody will link up and cause, hey, baby, you no, know, right now I had a bad day, blah, 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 bullshit. I talk to people all the time. I mean, gosh. I'm gonna skip to the part where I get married, have kids. Well, I don't know if the world's gonna last based on how this corona thing going. I don't know what's gonna go on. You know what I mean? But at the end of the day, people, well, I've been saying this a lot. It's just, I'm, I'm always real with you guys. And I hope you can see my, 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 my realness coming through my nervousness and whatever this is unscripted i don't plan these because these are coming from my heart and off the top of the dome and i just want to do this the first reaction to certain things and it really just gives me the rawness that you might need I'm, i don't know i don't know but yeah i have fears and insecurities like anybody else and i feel that there is a certain sector or a certain group of people that i don't think i can dive into or go give fully go into it fully because I have some barriers and I think to get rid of them I think I also have some real concerns that you know reputation wise if something would happen to in a relationship and then that hit hits Facebook or Twitter and it goes on or IG and you know, I can't but it's really messy a lot of messy stuff has happened and I, I, I don't talk about it but we can get to it in another day yeah so boom that's the dating scene for me um, hopefully there's somebody out there that likes man wants to send me a message on IG or Twitter wherever you want a Facebook comment or YouTube comment but there I'm not I don't bite I don't bite unless you want me to bite and then you know we're not getting to that because that's something for privileged persons only so that is that now I also want to um, look at the, the whole the use of there was something that somebody posted something on the Facebook group of Jamaicans in Japan I think or black people in Japan about how you know he I really appreciate if I don't you think that we should appreciate more when Japanese people wear braids or dress up like hip hop persons or whatever or cane roll or whatever or do wear the makeup like us or the big earrings and the attitude and I'm like 
All right, so first of all, you clearly are not in Japan. Second of all, you clearly don't really know how things work in this country and what happens for those persons of the culture that is being that you said should be paid homage to. Now, there, there were whole heap layers to this, and I was going to talk about I always want to talk specifically about dance hall and reggae culture, which is what that's the culture that I am a part of, that I grew up in. All right. Um, I think I spoke about this already on another video, but it just came up again recently because we had an experience. Um, this week, we played at two parties, two events. One was more supported by foreigners, one was mostly Japanese. One is more of a regular event, one is something that just started. So there are different factors that might affect the response of a crowd or a reaction to a set of artists playing. Now, I don't know, I'm a lively person, I'm hilarious. I'm not saying this, I'm not, this is a brag, but when I'm DJing or out there MCing, people are enjoying themselves, they're laughing, they're having a good time. Cool. Japanese or foreign, it no matter. Because I speak a little Japanese, I can do a little thing and switch in between. Now, the Japanese always try to prove how authentic they are when they do something. And the how they rate authenticity varies in the genre or the type of thing they're trying to do. A lot of them try to present themselves as going to Jamaica often so they knew about the culture. You know, they knew the culture properly and they link with whoever. And they try to link with other popular persons for the gram, for social media to get that clout. All right. A lot of the DJs here are subpar. I'm going to say they're subpar. All of them are okay, but some of them are not really that good. And they only can play either very old songs or very new songs. When it comes to mixing them to seamlessly to give a nice holistic experience of the dancehall and the reggae and the hip hop and the soca, they can't do it. But you know, it's not my place because it's Japan. And let me tell you, anybody from Jamaica or the Caribbean who comes here, they're going to take everything and they make it their own. So it's like, same thing with soca. You would think you won't, you really find the persons of the culture being involved with the culture here in this country. They'll take it and learn from you and they make it their own and then they act like they don't want to let you in. I've seen, I've been involved with events that have been cancelled because of Bad Man. Bad Man is here too, don't worry. In Japan I think they call it another name but I don't know what it's called. Um, the Doti. Yeah. Doti Hato. Kokoro wa kitanai. <laughs> what is that? I don't know. You're a Kokoro wa kitanai. Dirty heart. But that's literally dirty heart, you know? Um. Yeah, so even the event I went to, it wasn't a foreigner planned, it was another Japanese, some people from, some other Japanese zones or persons who are not fans of this zone, call the police. Because, whatever, whatever, for the reason. You know what I mean? Uh, we have seen, I've had friends who tried to put on events and Japanese didn't like, didn't want to be a part of it or they were saying, no, it must be done this way. I have been in parties or events i would be talking to DJs who are established in this in this dance hall here in Japan, and they said I've gone to Jamaica for 17 years. So and this is how this go. This man is telling me a Jamaican that he went to Jamaica for 17 years, so he know more about the culture than me. Generally speaking, that wouldn't fly. Maybe him know a DJ more than me. I don't think he can know my culture better than me. He shouldn't be able to. Although you know, technically, we shouldn't put numbers and stuff but you can't tell me a jamaican say you do this da, 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 da. and i as a jamaican can't tell you how it go I've, i lived it i didn't visit it you understand me just like how i can't come to japan and tell you about a, a samurai and can't tell you about a sushi i can't tell you about your food i can tell that to me in my opinion that it's i don't like it but it's not the way to be done and you should cook it this way but you know what the right way to do it and the traditional way to do it i should say the traditional way and the, the correct way i might have a modern take on it which is not exactly meshing with your whatever you understand me but at the end of the day you are the authentic person that makes a sushi we can't tell the japanese person to make jerk she came and tell me well i can't cook like them still i can't cook that well so i wouldn't even talk about the cooking part but invariably you find that a lot of persons of culture, like so soca people, are, sorry, dance all wise, you'd find that at one point I just came to Japan, the Jamaicans were really in intimately involved with the Japanese doing the festivals and the parties. But as time passes, you see less and less Jamaicans in the forefront or even involved at all. You know, 
And at the end of the day, you're like, yo, what is this mess? What is this mess that's really taking place? And Jamaicans, yo, we, not, we don't like to be a part of crap and garbage, you know. So we we'll take ourselves and just look on. But when we, when the watered down version or the the orientized, the 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 the, 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 the sushi version, when the, the the soy sauce version of our jerk chicken, our the, the our, our the war the green tea down. Right, the, the diluted version of our culture goes and is sold as the Jamaican culture. When they actually go to Jamaica or to places that have a strong, heavily, strong, heavy Jamaica influence, they're gonna say this is not real Jamaican. This, this is not real patty. This is not how patties. It shouldn't have so many spices. This is not jerk chicken. It should be this spicy. This is not what jerk chicken is. And don't you can't tell a Japanese they're wrong, you know. If you know anything about Japan, you cannot tell a Japanese person that they're wrong about something that they studied about or they knew about i have seen japanese people who don't speak english trying to correct me i'm like it's opposite i've seen foreigners here trying to correct a japanese person about japanese grammar i don't think i would try to do that but you know it's possible but it's rare that you're going to be able to do that it's going to be correct all right so you have those issues the whole fact that it's because it's cultural appropriation and it's culture jacking and swag jacking and all of that a lot of them can't speak english but they can't speak patois which i love so we can chat to them so and them understand what me i say but they can't they can't communicate like this no they can't do that i'm all for the spreading of the culture but i don't want the person of the culture to be to feel to feel ostracized or to be to be out of it or out of, to be put out of it and you know the dilution of the thing continues you know what i mean that's just me how do you how do you feel about that i mean is that shogunai situation is that something that that can't be helped you just make it stay and as you run its course or just is there recourse is there a way for us to ensure that you know there's a way of us sharing the culture while still maintaining the authentic the authenticity and the quality quality you understand me yeah I don't know. I don't. I don't know. Maybe I'm just sitting there. Because here's what happened at the event. So we, we do one event. We shell it down. Mad thing. We go to another part. A party in a reputed club in 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 Shibuya. We go and we play an early set where there's nobody there at all. Then people come and the main sound is there. They're doing the thing. They play for three hours, which is unheard of. Three hours in the middle. And at four o'clock, they say, "Hey, go on. You play." When we go on to play, first of all, we're two foreigners. All the Japanese girls just step back away from the stage, go and get them drinks, go and do whatever. So we try to continue the same battles before us. So play some nice dancing, whitening song for the girl and get mad and wine. And after six minutes of juggling and seeing that there was no response, we just look and he hit, yo, yo, screw this, no, bad man thing, you know. I want to some bad man song. I want to play some song, you know. I want to make some chat, you know, like I mean, so, yo. Me not beg no friend in here, none of them boys in them bad than me or Riri. Run that cow down, run there. The massacre, drug lord, dub plate. A couple of people, then they reel up, and then by that time, all foreigner friends come up from downstairs. I was like, it's a vibe, and built up on one, and the people are real. One guy came up and gave us a money pull up when we were playing, because we were juggling. But yo, man, I tell you what's juggling, good juggling. Now. Nice mix of some dance, you know, man. Play the ritual, we play the skeng. The place is like, good, good, that is me. Wasn't playing Yahoo boys, never playing that <coughs> Play it, we get a money pull up and thing, and we do one play our set for 30 minutes and cut. As soon as me, the British guy and the Jamaican leave the stage and a Japanese DJ comes up, him start playing some foolishness and the girl him come back. Hmm. And the girls came back. Out of discussion with another Jamaican who has been here for a while, um, a lot of rumors are being spread about Jamaicans. And Jamaican DJs or foreign DJs or foreigners in general by the Japanese persons who play in the zone and his girls coming back to tell the person that so there's clearly a little campaign going on that I don't really appreciate but it is what it is at the end of the day because what what God plan nobody can stop so then people can go on but which can be no say mad so mad so anyway good we don't do that now let us get into um what else have I been on my mind today? So yeah, the SOE has been lifted, state of emergency has been lifting, so there are events happening again, restaurants are serving alcohol again, people are outside again, the percentage of persons that have been vaccinated has, is equal to the amount that's been done in America, I think like 67%. So they're getting the second doses coming up and people are getting their vaccinations going. You know my situation, Shogunai. 
I saw it go. I can't get vaccinated until next year because of the treatment that I did uh, in the hospital for the corona. So I can't do any form of traveling because I know they're going to tie that into traveling and visa application. <sighs> so for Christmas, I don't know what I mean for Christmas yet, but I hope to have you guys involved as well. You know, my other things. Hopefully, my hair is a bit longer. But you're not here, girl, man. Jeez, I just feel so handsome. Thank you again, Trudy Quelly, for all your hair needs. Follow her on Instagram. Uh, recently, I've been also pushed by one of my patrons, a friend, uh, a long time subscriber and friend. I think he's been more consistent. But I mean, I've been so tired of being consistent, you know. Seven years on this platform, only with 12,000 subscribers. And, um, you know, it gets frustrating sometimes see how the person going faster and you doing things but i know it's not about them it's about you guys and i need you guys to continue to support me because i love you and i think that you love me interestingly you know japan has been a wonderful opportunity for me it might be time to hang it up it might be time to leave because you know the world is ending and i haven't started my family that's the most important thing. i need to get my family on the go i'm sure i have persons jamaica canada uk waiting on me to come over there and to have my babies i'm kidding I'm, I'm <laughs> but yeah um japan has really opened my eyes opened the horizon for me exposed me to a lot of things and other, other nations you know i experienced that in jamaica and america but i mean japan has exposed me to a lot of persons on a long-term basis uh, i've made lifelong changing decisions here yeah um every girl that i've that i've been involved with romantically is either married has, has been is married yes have children no so that's it if you want to have babies ladies come there with me first then go do your man or come have a little relationship with me first then go find your husband clearly i am the the one before you know the one the penultimate man before <laughs> <laughs> no wonder that's not funny. Yeah, so it is what it is. But make sure you cop the merch. Patrons, we got myself, my six or seven patrons. Can't remember my names right now because I don't remember my name. There's Adam, there's not. Ah, now we call the names. But well, thank you to my patrons. I put your names here below. If you want to become a patron member, PDG Nation, the link is also down below. If you want exclusive stuff, things that won't be shown on my channel. Yeah. All right, the live streams, I don't know when they'll be back. I'll let you know with an announcement. But it is what it is. At the end of the day, people. If you can't be able to be creative, I want you guys to enjoy and live your life to the fullest and deal with people properly. Find new opportunities every day to better yourself. Develop yourself. Yeah, man. And also my music. Wow. Um, that's taking a break. I'm making some new songs. Um, so look out for that coming in October, November, and December. All right. Halloween. Don't know what's happening for Halloween yet. I might not stay in my yard. But we link up. All right. Peace. Because the guy to Jamaican YouTuber. Pickles the guy in Jamaican YouTuber promoting his new merch and talking about dating in Japan after COVID and all those wonderful things. Pickles the guy in Jamaican YouTuber. Iki, 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 God damn it. Tell me where we're going to be.